Hey, what's up guys? It's Matt here. Welcome to another house tour. If you're new to the channel, we post a new house tour every day on this channel and we're touring loads throughout the UK. Today, I'm in Monton here in Manchester, close to Monton Village. I'm gonna be showing you a four bedroom detached home that is only three years old. And I'm with Summer and we're gonna show you around, aren't we Summer? Yeah, so it's on the market for 600,000. That's right. It's listed with Murthy Waldron Estate Agents and their details will be in the description below if you want any more information. Let's start at the front then. So we can see we have off-road parking for three or four cars and we've obviously got the single garage as well, which we'll show you more of when we go inside. So the house actually backs onto a fielded area, which we'll see more upstairs. There's a balcony we can show you as well. And it's a no through road, so it's very quiet. As yeah. you can see, this house is gated back there and this is what the estate looks like. Yeah, it's a very chilly day though, so we are gonna get inside. Lots to show you guys, so come yeah. on through. Thanks guys for all your suggestions to come to this area. Make sure if you're watching this and you want us to come to your area, comment below and we'll do some tours. You've got back access just off the front door here. And let's okay. go in. Shoes off, of course, keep everywhere nice and neat. Here we are in the entrance. So come on through. On the first right, we have the main formal living area. As I mentioned, the home is only three years old, so everything feels very, very new, and I must say very well looked after. We've got this quirky Paul Smith light in the corner. I really like that. Yeah, it looks good, doesn't it? So back through to the main hall, just on the right. I know everyone likes to see all the storage cupboards, everything, so this is under stairs, and it actually goes all the way around. So you've got coat storage at the front and then shoes and stuff at the back. Okay, main family area through here. That is so warm. I gravitate over to this to just kind of warm my hands up. That is really nice. Really nice, right? Especially in a newer property. And the way I think it fits perfectly into the corner is a good design. Got a piano here for the music yeah. lovers. So this is like a kind of snug seating area, somewhere cozy by the fire. You could have a TV up here or something if you wanted to. And then towards this side, we've obviously got a dining table and then doors out onto the garden. You can show the garden here, Summer. So we have patio and lawn, and it backs onto a field. Yeah, take a look through that back window. There we go. So obviously we're viewing this in the winter time in the UK. I can imagine in spring and summer, that looks really nice. Keep coming through. I'm liking the- um, Exposed brick. Exposed brick, that's yes. the word, yes. Yeah, nice, right? Okay. And here, this is cool, so this is a Siemens fridge freezer. All black. Yeah. Not seen this before, but I really like it. And you can change the temperature. So this is the kitchen area. As you can see, this also looks onto the back of the house. What do you guys think to this style design? Let us know in the comments below what you're thinking. So on this side of the kitchen, we have the gas five ring hob. Yeah, it's a Bosch hob. And you've got the extractor above that as well. Lots of storage. Got a wine cooler actually as well through here, built in. Yeah. Here are the two ovens. They are Lamona ovens. Very nice. And then here we have the utility, which again, which keeps everything tucked away. And now, in terms of storage, we've got another decent cupboard for sure, which of course in the new build is something everyone looks for. And then through here, downstairs, that we see. There we go, and the basin. Yep, that's good. And so I mentioned there's a single garage when we're at the front. Let's take a look from the inside. So somewhere for your motorbike, all you need really in a garage. And obviously you've got logs for the fire and the Worcester boiler is at the back wall. So this looks like a door that goes, yeah, so it's a Electric. Of course, it goes straight up. Up and up and in that thing. <laughs> yeah, up and in that thing. <laughs> Here's another look at the kitchen from this angle. It is very wide. Also, guys, by the way, property is fully alarmed. Come back to this log burn again. I really like that. Yeah, I could just have a nap on that sofa right now. <laughs> <laughs> guys, and remember, keep commenting where you think we should tour next. We always love reading all of your comments. Now back in the hall, we're gonna work our way upstairs and show you the first floor. So here we are on the upstairs landing, but some of us me your camera, we'll swap and you can show everyone this okay, floor. Okay, I'm gonna be the tour guide now. 
If you're new to the channel, guys, we're not agents, by the way. We're basically just created a channel touring loads of properties around the UK. We actually used to be agents, so that's how we have got into the property industry ourselves. But that's just a bit of background about us. Yeah, no, it's good to know. This is the master bedroom. I'll put the room dimensions on the screen. And you've also got windows looking over your back garden. Let me come and show you. Let's see if you can see through them. Yeah. And this is the room from this side, as you can see. And then let's go into the ensuite. Dual sinks with the LED nice. mirrors. I really want one of these. They're good, aren't they? Yes. The shower's around here. And you've got windows. With Frosted windows, windows yeah. yeah. I like these as well to put your radio. Oh, that's hot. <laughs> yep, that's tend to be what they do. <laughs> Certainly somewhere this that you could move straight in. It's very neutral. Yeah. You know, it's hard to find things not to like. Yeah. Obviously, you can change it to your own personal style, can't you? And there's not really much furniture, so you yeah. can visualise what you'd put in here. Here's another bedroom. Double bed would fit in here comfortably. Yeah, for sure. And space for wardrobes too. I'll show you guys this side. So that's the room and then the view back out onto the landing area. Okay, let's head back. This is the airing cupboard. Yep. Great. This bedroom's different, so it's a bit um, of a unique shape. Yeah, so you've got a bay at the front, haven't you, which is good. Yeah. I think without that bay, it may feel a little snug, but yeah, not too bad. Bed on this side and where you're standing now, Matt, would be the perfect place for built-in wardrobes. Yeah, that's right. To kind of level that off. Yeah, go into there so you can just see, yeah, so perspective, you can uh, have <laughs> custom bespoke wardrobes in there. Yeah, okay. Keep moving. Modern family bathroom. Nice tiles. You got your bath in here, so you got the shower and the master ensuite and bath in this one. Yeah. And a really cool, modern. Same bathroom. LED on the mirror as well. Yeah. Nice. Okay. This room's cool, it's because it's got the Juliet balcony. Yes. Okay, so all the room sizes are really good. There's certainly no box room. No, there isn't. And this is a double room too, yeah. I'd say. Come to this corner of the room and then I can show you across that you comfortably have your bed either, the, yeah, probably that side across here and then... Juliet balcony. Juliet balcony, yeah. So we are quite close to Morton Primary School, which the owner was saying is quite popular. Yeah, Morton, Morton, Morton sorry, Primary guys. School um, is a really good primary school apparently to get into. So that's close by here. And it's about a 15 minute walk to the tram to get into Manchester city centre. So we're personally not from Manchester, so we don't know a huge amount about the area, but it seems pretty good. Now we've toured the entire house. Let's go check out the garden and go back downstairs. All right, guys, so this is, oh, just in the puddle. This is the garden. Um, so you've got, I believe, an access point here. So there's the gate. So obviously from the front, and then a fairly open view, you know, you've got to think as a fairly new property, usually you have new builds directly behind you in most areas, in most cases. But yeah, quite an open view, I would say. Let's have a look round here. So it actually goes all the way round. This is where your kitchen oh, yeah. is. So bins and stuff around there that you can keep tucked out of the way. That's the view. Yeah. And it's made out of Cheshire brick. That's right. This is what it looks like from the back. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed looking around this home. Make sure to smash that like button, help us out with the YouTube algorithm. We really appreciate it. And obviously subscribe if you want to see more house tours. We'll see you in tomorrow's video. And while you're here, why don't you drop a comment of where you think we should tour next. But for now, see you soon.